On this day, we celebrate American independence. The Fort Hood community remembers a soldier who sacrificed his life to protect ours. Good evening, everyone, and thanks for joining us at 10 on this Independence Day holiday. I'm Dennis Turner. In Capper's Cove right now, a family grieves the loss of Sergeant James Johnston, killed last week in combat. Today, loved ones, friends, and caring strangers celebrated his life with a barbecue and fellowship. As Maggie Lou Miller shows us, Sergeant Johnson leaves a legacy of patriotism. I was lucky enough to go through all of this with him and hold his hand through EOD school and graduation, and he was my best friend. Sergeant James Johnston's life was cut short defending our country in Afghanistan last week. He sacrificed everything, everything for this country. James was the epitome of an American soldier. He was a true American warrior and everybody should be proud of, of him. Today his family, friends and caring strangers came to celebrate his memory with a barbecue. This is exactly what he would want. You know, James didn't like negative vibes and he always tried to lift people up. He always tried to bring out the brighter side of things. There are people trying to make the trek from all over and just knowing that that they're on their way has been so, it's made it so much easier. Clad in Hawaiian shirts, Guess recalled his joyful spirit. He was a very crazy, bold person uh, with an outgoing personality, so the Hawaiian shirts kind of just became his signature look. Upstairs, a nursery is prepared for Johnston's daughter, who is due in a few months. He was so excited to have his baby girl. He found out the day before he left for Afghanistan and we've been together for seven years and I had never seen him cry until that day. So that's something I'll cherish forever. Jamie Avery Grace Johnston, named after her father, will know his heroic tale. And while she will never meet her dad, his legacy will be carried on through her. She will know exactly who her father was, what he meant to me, what he meant to everybody else and exactly how much of a hero he was. Maggie Law Miller, Central Texas News Now. A dignified transfer ceremony in honor of Sandra Johnson takes place tomorrow morning. The solemn service marks the final journey home for a U.S. soldier and it remains closed to the public. But Central Texas News Now will cover the event.